Greetings in Jesus' name and welcome to our devotions today. My name is Bishop T. Nalo. Now, most of us have heard the song, What a Friend We Have in Jesus. But most of us do not know who wrote this song and why. The song was written by Joseph Medicot Scriven between 1819 and 1886. That is a long time for a song to have remained relevant to today. Now, Scriven was engaged to get married, but on the night before his wedding, his fiancée drowned and died. Scriven was left with a lot of grief. He left his own land of Ireland and decided to go to start a new life in Canada. Now, tragedy and grief has a way of either drawing us closer to God or pushing us away from God. Whatever issues you face today have a way of either drawing you to God or pushing you away from God. For Scriven, his tragedy drew him closer to God and made God or Jesus become a personal friend to him. I may not know what you're going through today or what you're experiencing right now, but I know that Jesus desires to be your personal and close friend. The Bible says in um, Philippians chapter 4, verse 6 and 7 from the New Living Translation, Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank Him for all He has done. If you do this, you will experience God's peace, which is far more wonderful than the human mind can understand. His peace will guard your heart and mind as you live in Christ Jesus. I want to encourage you today that whatever things that are happening in your life, whatever tragedy, whatever problem, let them draw you closer to God and not further away from God. Make Jesus your friend and tell him what it is that is troubling your mind today. Let me pray with you. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for granting us this day. Thank you for the gift of life and thank you for the blessing of life. Thank you for your mercies. Today I pray that you help us to make you our friend, that we can come to you with our issues and with our problems and share them with you as a friend so that we can experience peace that your word promises. I pray for my listeners today that you will help them with their problems and issues and anything that they are going through. May they experience peace that only you can give. I pray that we will experience peace in our families, peace between husband and wife, between children and their parents, and between siblings. I also pray that you will help us with inner peace, that whatever we are going through, whether financial, relational, physical, that we will find peace in you. I pray also for this nation, that our nation will experience peace and that the citizens of this nation will learn to make you their friend so that they can bring their issues and their problems to you. I pray that this day will be a blessed day. May you go ahead of us that whatever we encounter today will share with you as a friend. Thank you. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name, I pray. Now, this devotion has been brought to you courtesy of Praise Chapel, Mombasa. We are located in Kizingo area along General Madenge Road, right opposite Aga Khan Hospital. We have two services every Sunday, 7.30 a.m. and 9.30 a.m. Welcome to Fellowship Winners. God bless you.